<laughs> Hi, I'm Arlene and I am back again with another video. Today, I am going to talk about, if I can get it together, I'm going to talk about everything that I got from Bath and Body Works SAS sale or semi-annual sale. Okay, so I am going to start with the candles. Well, no, let me start. First of all, I went in, this is day one, um, to the semi-annual sale. I picked up a lot of things that I thought I might want. I did not smell a lot of them. I just went by some of the um, reviews that I heard people saying on YouTube or just some of the name of the fragrances, the fragrance notes. I didn't really smell a lot of things. I just bought them. And when I got home, I went through what I wanted and what I didn't want. So you're going to see what I'm keeping. A lot of it is going back to the store. Because if I kept all that stuff, it would be ridiculous. It would be like I lost my mind. But a lot of it is going back. So let's start with the candles. Okay, so this is a candle that I've had before. This is the iced coconut milk. Very beautiful scent. Throws good, smells good. Um, it filled up my bedroom. When I put it in the living room, it filled up the living room. If I left it in my bedroom and left my bedroom door open, you will smell it out into the living room. It's a very good candle, good performing, good smelling. The notes are... Fresh coconut milk, crushed ice, topped with sweet vanilla cream. Beautiful. Or, beautiful. <laughs> the next one I have, this is new, is the hot fudge drizzle. Okay. This is what it looks like. It is a mm. It smells like a hot fudge. Well, they did a good job on this. It smells like um, hot fudge and ice cream. Oh, very good. So, this has notes of rich melted chocolate, vanilla bean, dash of brown sugar, beautiful on cold it smells like it's going to be a good throw um it smells like realistic chocolate fudge to me and ice cream this smells good i think i'm gonna light this up pretty soon and it smells like it's gonna be sweet and creamy This one is the Pink Petal Tea Cake. It's a lot of buzz on YouTube about this one. I'm gonna start talking louder. I think my voice might be low, so let me speak up. There's a lot of buzz about this Pink Petal Tea Cake on YouTube. So I picked it up when I seen it. I didn't even really smell it. I did smell it when I got home. This smells like a perfumed cake. <laughs> That's what it smells like. It smells like perfume and it smells like cake. I really like this. I can't remember what they said on YouTube, the candle channel. Nick, I think his name is. No, that might be somebody else, but the candle channel. I know he spoke about it about a month ago. I can't remember if he said it had a good throw or not, 
but it does smell lovely. It's pink rose petals, pound cake, vanilla glaze. Oh my goodness, this smells really good to me. I'm excited to have that. I hope it, um, when I light it up, it smells just as good and fill up my bedroom. I have one more that I'm keeping. This is hot cocoa and cream. I heard people talk about this candle. I guess it came out at, I don't know if it was this Christmas or last Christmas. I think it was maybe the last Christmas that people were talking about it. Um, like they were remembering what it smelled like. This one smells good too, but I think this hot fudge drizzle smells better. Okay. I guess I'm 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 imagining why I think it smells better because that is ice cream. I love ice cream. So that has more of the sweet creaminess. And this is more like hot chocolate. So it says decadent milk chocolate, fresh steamed milk, mini marshmallows. Okay, I can see this be um smelling good also, but I'm not in a hurry to light this one like I am the hot fudge drizzle. I do like my choices because after having that, um, what was it, sweet, sweet something um, during Valentine's Day, that really put me in the mood for chocolate um, smelling candles. So I'm hoping that these candles do as good as i can't remember what it was sweet something the one that smelled like the box of chocolates if it smells anything like that it'll be a thumbs up for me okay so let me see what the prices were because i end up doing two orders because they would not let me put my coupons together a ten dollar coupon and a twenty percent off coupon so, I got the hot cocoa um, candle for $9.45. The pink petal tea cake candle for $9.45. The hot fuzz drizzle for $9.45. And then well, goodness, where are the candles listed? Oh, and then I got Whatever other candle it is, I got it for $9.56. So they end up being a little bit cheaper with the $10 off. But as you see, I got a ridiculously long bill. And a lot of this stuff is going back. Okay, what's not going back? Let me turn this around are my um wallflowers so the wallflowers girl get it together the wallflowers i got them for 280 a piece so the scents i got in all of these i got three of them um three each. So I got the Island Margarita, 
It is the Enhanced Fragrance. It says it's Fruity Happy. It's the Sweet Mandarin, Island Mango, and Sea Salt. I have three of those. Then I have the Cucumber Melon, the Enhanced Fragrance. It is su Summer Cantaloupe, Crisp Cucumber, and Fresh Honeydew Melon. I have three of these. Then I got the Mango Mai Tai Enhanced Fragrance. It has notes of fresh mango nectar, exotic jasmine, sun-kissed grapefruit. Got three of those. Then I have the toasted pineapple marshmallow. It's also an enhanced fragrance. It has notes of fresh pineapple, milk chocolate, toasty marshmallows, graham cracker. I didn't read the notes on this until I got home. I was surprised that it had milk chocolate, marshmallows, and graham cracker. Graham cracker. Toasted pineapple marshmallow. I didn't even pay attention that it said marshmallow in the um, title. I just seen pineapple. <laughs> and I thought the little picture on there was pretty indifferent. So then I have watermelon lemonade. It's also an enhanced fragrance. It has watermelon ice, sparkling water, Meyer lemon. This should smell good. I have three of those. Let's see, did I get them all? Nope. I have Coconut Lime Breeze. It's an enhanced fragrance. It has Zesty Lime, Lemon Verbena, and Sheer Coconut. I have been enjoying coconut fragrances lately. I really enjoyed the um, Waikiki Coconut Beach. Okay, that's all the fragrances I got. So I have, <coughs> excuse me, I have three of each. So I have one, two, three, four, five, six. So I have 18 wallflowers with six different fragrances. Okay, we're gonna get into the bag. This is something that I never bought before, but I do keep antibacterial wash, uh, not wash, but wipes in my car. So I picked these up. I think these are 75% off. I have the uh, strawberry pound cake. Sunshine and Lemons, Champagne Toast. All of these are a package of 30. I think they end up being like a dollar something a piece. Let's see if I can find it quickly. Okay, a dollar 70 a piece. So they were like 75% off. And I got the three fragrances that I seen. Okay. One of the ladies at the checkout counter gave me a coupon that allowed me to get a hand soap for $3. So I picked up the Boardwalk Vanilla Cone. I was trying to get some kind of vanilla that Shonda C talked about on her channel that was in like a pearlescence packaging, but they were sold out. So I got this one instead. Smells pretty good. I didn't even smell it in the store. Like I said, I didn't smell a lot of things in the store. So let me see. 
I know these were all the same price. If I can find it quickly. Maybe. Maybe not. Okay. White t-shirt. So these three items that I'm going to show, I think they all were $3.29. Oh, maybe not because they're all different items. So they were around $3.29. Might be a little bit more, a little bit less. Got things in my eye. I have a three, $3.09, $3.29. So it was around that price, like I said. So I end up getting the white t-shirt shower gel, because I don't have it. And I got another white t-shirt fragrance mist. I was gonna um, return these, but they only were three something and I do like this fragrance. And I have an additional, I can't remember if it's the hyaluronic acid lotion or just a regular lotion of white t-shirt. And so I just got another fragrance mist because I do enjoy this scent. I That's the only backup I have. I did buy a couple more backups, but I'm taking them back to the store. So... I have the Fiji Sunshine Guavatini Lotion. I have the spray. I haven't used it yet, but it is a um, tropical scent. So I have a lot of, a tropical summery scent. I have a lot of these Escada sprays over here. I figured I could mix them with those. Now the scent notes on the Fiji, Fiji Sunshine Guavatini are Sunkissed Guava, Fresh Orange, Seaside Jasmine. I didn't tell you the notes on white t-shirt, but they are crisp pear, fresh white t-shirt, lavender cloud, clean musk, soft sandalwood. My hand is itching. Does that mean I'm getting some money? I need some. So. Oh, these almost look alike. Okay, so I got the Beach Nights. I have a set. This is so crazy. I've gone back into getting sets. And... At one time, I was only, for years, I was only getting the fragrance mist. But I have a whole set here. I have the Beach Nights Body Lotion. This one is the Daily Nourishing. It has shea butter and coconut oil. And then I have the shower gel and the fragrance mist. Did I say the night? The name, the name is, uh, the name is Beach Nights. The fragrance notes are toasted marshmallow, sea salt breeze, s'mores accord, beach driftwood, and creamy vanilla. Like I said, I didn't really smell these in the store. I smelled them when I got home. And I remember this one is sweet. It took me off guard. Because it's sweet and creamy. I smell the marshmallow and s'mores type notes in it. The sweetness, the vanilla. I was very surprised. It really took me off guard. So it smells good to me. 
and that's beach nights. Then I got, or I'm keeping the Sunset Glow. Just look at these packaging, the packaging on here real quick. It'll throw you off if you're not looking real closely. This one has the little um, gold sparkles at the top. But they look very similar. Anyway, we're talking about the Sunset Glow. So, my goodness. I got a whole set of the Sunset Glow. I have the Shower Gel, the Fragrance Mist, and the um, Body Cream. I like the Body Cream. So... Let's see, this has notes of fresh cotton, sparkling cherry seltzer, dreamy moonflower, caramelized sugar. I think I got the cherry when I first smelled. Let's see. Yeah, I'm getting the cherry notes. Mm. This actually reminds me of Into the Night a bit. I like this. It has a sweet scent. Has a little bit of that um, base that you need, the deepness, deepness in the flavor, in the scent, in the fragrance, I mean. Oh, I like that. Okay. And last but not least is the Cotton Candy Clouds. I have a whole set of this. I have the Fragrance Mist, the Body Lotion, and the Shower Gel. This one has a big buzz on the um, YouTubes. A lot of people like this Cotton Candy Clouds. They're excited for it to be back. Um, I think this is the one that they say smell like um, whipped meringue or something like that. And it smells like something else. Um, the fragrance notes are sponge sugar, pink berries, whipped vanilla. Have that pink berries and something else. I don't know. This is my first time having any of these fragrances, except for the white t-shirt and the guavatini. I haven't worn the guavatini though. Oh yeah, this is nice and sweet and berry. It actually puts me in the mind of a uh, strawberry pound cake. I haven't smelled them side by side, but just smelling it like this, that's what it reminds me of. I think this will add a nice, um, sweet berry note to lots of fragrances. Hmm. I have a spicy perfume here that I keep playing with because I'm trying to see what I can wear it with where I would really like it. I know it would go well with vanilla, but I need a vanilla that's strong enough. Let that air out a minute. Well, while I play with this, um, this is the last of my fragrances. I should say fragrances, but the last of my haul. And actually, I think I'm going to stay out of the big semi-annual sale i think i have enough here to last me i have lots of fragrances that i have not had a chance to play with and get through so 
I need to start using my collection more and playing with them and have some empties <laughs> of fragrance mists and lotions and shower gels before I buy more. I just need to stay out of Bath and Body Works. I need to see how I'm going to actually put all these fragrances to work. Let's see. It's doable, but it's a bit spicy. I would have to check these out when it gets colder outside. I keep trying to mix this with something that will be really pleasant to my nose where I'm like, yes, I want to wear that. I haven't found it yet. Oop. It doesn't smell bad, but it's not jumping out at me like, oh, in the wintertime, I think this is going to be beautiful. So, with that being said, I do think I don't have to wait till wintertime for cotton candy clouds to be beautiful to wear because it smells good. I can see me mixing it with a lot of things. And that's the end of this video. Okay. Thanks everybody for watching. Welcome to my new subscribers. Please keep liking, sharing, commenting, um, you're really helping my channel to grow, and I appreciate all the love and the support, and I will see you on the next one. Thanks for watching. Bye!